Hello <clears throat> and welcome back to TAB Vlogs and Curiously Exploring with Therese Branson and I say that that way because I do intend on putting this video on both of my YouTube channels. I know it's been a while since I've made a video for either one and I'd like to apologize. However, I think this one deems worthy of putting on both channels. We are in Saxonburg, Pennsylvania and we are here working. Um, we are staying at a bed and breakfast here in Saxonburg. It is called the Mainstay Bed and Breakfast. Uh, it's a house that was built in 1835, I believe is what it was. Um, I'll show the paper showing the history and stuff. Um, the founder of Saxonburg is, uh, was from, um, sorry about that, Germany, and like I said, I'll show you a paper, and you can pause the video and read that, but I want to give you guys a tour of this bed and breakfast. Uh, the only room that I'm not going to be able to actually go in and show you is the one that's behind me here. Um, and it's because it's rented, but there are photos downstairs in the library of this room, so I will be able to show it to you that way. Um, when I get into the room that we're staying in, which is called the Pine Suite, I'm going to be quiet because my husband's resting right now and I don't want to disturb him. But uh, I just thought that what better way to come back then with a tour of this really nice bed and breakfast um, there's only four rooms that he rents um, two of the rooms have their own bathrooms and then the other two rooms there's a two restrooms in the hallway upstairs uh, he does a continental breakfast every morning there's a library then another sitting room and then of course the dining room and the kitchen and you have access to the refrigerator in the kitchen and the stove and a microwave so like I said I'll give you guys a tour and let you guys see what we're staying at and uh, I'll show you I'm out on the upstairs outside balcony right now uh, I'll show you around it and I'll show you the outside of the Florida room and it's called the Florida room because it's Florida themed uh, I'll show you the back courtyard and the building that the the guy that founded this town is actually the guy that uh, created the steel cable wire so he worked out of the building back here I'll, I'll show you that and, and there's a headstone and um, possibly tonight I'm going to do another video uh, with this Necrophonics app which is Spirit Box and see if we can get any you know any communication there but uh, let's uh, go ahead and show you the outside this little balcony and the yard in that building and uh, then we'll get on with uh, the tour. And I'm sorry for any wind noise you may be hearing. It is quite windy here today. But this is the door that goes into the Florida room. Uh, it has its own restroom. Uh, there's a diner also beside this bed and breakfast in this same big house and there is an upstairs one bedroom apartment above it which is on the other side of the Florida room um, this is the window to the bathroom in the room that we're staying at and that's the window to one of the other bathrooms I was telling you about that's the door to come out onto the balcony and this is the balcony I'm going too fast, I'm sorry. And, uh, that's the door to go inside. The office is, like, over there. This is the courtyard in the back. And 
Let's see. This is the building where the guy used to make the steel cable, and that's a headstone right there. So, um, and this is also an old house that is a hotel now. It is called the Saxonburg Inn Hotel. So, um, I've not been in it, don't know much about it. Um, I do know that it was built in 1832, so, and that's old business there behind that. And, um, uh, so, yeah, um, there may be a couple of cuts in this video. If there is, I'm sorry, but, um, I wanted to show you that outside of this first and I am also going to show you the outside front of it on the outside okay okay now this is the parking area for the bedroom now, as I said he only has four rooms so he has limited parking and this is the this side of the building where the guy built the um, steel cable and this is the name of the place we're at mainstay at Saxonburg in the courtyard in the walkway this is how we entered the balcony the courtyard this is the back entrance and the guy that owns and runs this bed and breakfast office is right there when this was the house that was the kitchen he has very nice decor in here this is a very very nice place Jim is his name. His dog's name is Bentley. And they're great hosts. And this is the dining room where you eat your breakfast. It's very nice. And he is a very nice man. This is the kitchen. This is a beautiful house. And he's taken very well, very good care of it. Real lights. I guess that's what those are called. The refrigerator. And of course the sink. All cabinets with glass doors except for that one. And that one. And of course the bottom one is dead. But and then this is like a lobby slash sitting room. Very nice. Lots of green green plants and stuff. It's very exquisite. If I'm going too fast, I'm sorry. I just kind of want to get everything. So you guys can get a good visual on this place. It is, it is a really nice place. And Jim is very nice. And there's Bentley. This is the... Breezeway, the front door, the plants, 
And there's a step up here to go into the library. This is a picture of the front of the bed and breakfast. Jim's out there, which I can't really see. There he is, in the white shirt. And he has these little pamphlets. That's the front of the bed and breakfast. Very nice. It's, it's it. In, in, I don't know what the lights are called. But anyhow. <laughs> they will go upstairs. Each one of the rings. Oh, just a minute. I can't show you this room because it is rented out. This is the Florida themed room. Luckily he has photos, and he has photos of all rooms. The pine suites, the one my husband and I are in. This is safari. Okay, so that's the only one I can't show you. It's the Florida thing, you know? The details on that lamp. Wow. This place is truly amazing. I could stay here forever. So the first room we're going to go in is the safari room. All his fans in here are controlled remotely. They have a remote control. This guy also does staging for real estate properties when people are going to sell homes. He goes into real estate properties and stages them for viewing. And every room has ropes for the casts and extra cover and a fire escape ladder. antique stuff. This dresser is antique. And every room has two bottles of water. And that's the balcony where I started the video at. And here's one of the bathrooms that goes with the safari thing group. Standard tub. No shower accommodation. No deep rooms. And of course the toilets behind the door. Very nice. More green plants.
here's the other restaurant. This is the mission run of the king size bed. Also has a closet with the robes and stuff in it. And the armoire is where the TV is at. And that right there is the remote for the cell phone. History on this bed of breakfast. Now we're going into the current room, which is the room we're staying in. Oh, excuse my husband, he is his own. This
This is all the rooms other than the Florida room, which I cannot show you. But Jim is very kind, and his dog is precious. So I will make a, another outside video in a little while and show you the front of the building. So uh, I hope you enjoyed, and if you're ever in Pennsylvania, Western Pennsylvania, you need a comfy, nice place to stay. I mostly, I very much suggest you come and stay at Main State and Saxonburg. This bed and breakfast is awesome. Thank you, and have a blessed day. As I said, actually, I'm not going to close out the video. There's just going to be a cut in it because I want to video the front of the outside. But until I do that, peace. This is the outside front of the bed and breakfast that we are staying at. And this is the hotel next door. This building here was built in 1832. And this one in 1835. This is the little diner. This is a batten and dance studio. This is Main Street of Saxonburg. The big church up there. With the clock tower. This is a German built building here. This property is for sale. These are glass pieces that the original owner of this house made. Glass insulators. Guest register. This is Butler County.
I make another sign. That uh, Christmas, they have a they have a parade right there in front of here on Main Street, and right down Main Street. I think I'm gonna keep that little sign. And I'm gonna make sure I got at least uh, fifty or hundred dollars in my pocket just in case. <coughs> and I'm gonna take my sign, and when the, when the parade starts down through there, I'm gonna run out there and right in front of the. Marsh, Grand Marsh, or whatever it is that kind of leads to the parade. And I'm gonna well, hello again. And I decided that I learned, excuse me, that the Florida room is now available. So I'm going to give you a tour of it. And we're going to do a spirit box session tonight in a couple of the rooms and maybe downstairs just to see if we can get anything. And I got my K2 meter and a little recorder, voice recorder. So let's go look at the Florida theme room. Unfortunately, my camera is not waterproof, so we're not going to really be able to uh, go down there to video because it's raining. Let's go have a look at this Florida theme here. goes into a one bedroom apartment. Okay. Now this camera does have um, night vision. So, uh, I might use that a little tonight, because I kind of want it to be dark when I, uh, there we go, put a little more light on. I guess that's the little closet for this room. I'm guessing this room may, yeah, it has air conditioning. It's pretty warm over here. I don't know why it's so warm in here. But, yep, this is the Florida theme room. And it's got a new TV. That's green. It has its own little bathroom. It's the smallest bathroom of them all. And as you can see, Florida thing. Just a regular tub. So, we will probably come here first. Do our first little session here. It's just kind of creepy. But anyway, I just wanted you guys to be able to see the Florida theme. Okay, well, until later when we do our spirit box session and see what we can find out about this place, I'm going to let you guys go. If you're ever in this area and you want a nice, cozy, friendly environment to stay, I suggest you come here in Saxonburg. Very, very lovely place. Very, very good host. Thank you. Well, I hope you enjoyed the tour of this bed and breakfast here in Saxonburg, Pennsylvania. I almost ended my video without doing my usual. So I decided that I would turn my camera back on and close out this video like I do the rest of them. 
Thank you for watching. Remember to like, share, and subscribe. And I'm going to try to get you guys more content. Remember you are in control of your own destiny. You're the ones that has to live with the decisions that you make. So choose your decisions wisely. Because sometimes they do affect other people. Godspeed. Peace. I love you all. God bless.